Boston Jewish community, the single largest contingent from any city all around America. JFNA Solidarity Mission. We went to Stay Rote, and in Stay Rote, we met a woman named Michal. Michal is a mother whose teenage children have not slept in their own beds for years. Years! Because Stay Road has been under fire, not just since the beginning of July, but for years. Michal told us of a siren that had gone off when her kids were a little younger, and they were playing in the garden. Her husband ran out to gather her children to bring them to the safe room, and he insisted that they go in first. And there he was, closing the safe room door as a rocket fell right next door to their home, shattering the glass and injuring badly his hand. But Michal, at that point, told their children, we are Israeli. We shake it off. We go on. Then another rocket came. And this time Michal was driving. And she pulled over to try to get into a nearby house's safe room. But the door was locked. The rocket landed so close that she was thrown up into the air, landing on her back. And as the rescue crews came to try to help her, Another siren went off, and they had to retreat to safety, leaving her there, exposed, unable to move. She was badly injured and lost her hearing for three months, but she said, we are Israeli. We shake it off. We go on. Knowing that you are not alone. Knowing 
that you are supported and that you are safe knowing your friends will stand with you. And that is what we, all of us, must commit to do here today for Michal and for all of our people in the land of Israel. will give way to a new calm. There is so much work yet to do. It is up to us to maintain faith with Michal, to support her with not just our hearts, but most importantly, our hands, through actions that Jeremy will share with us in just a few moments. And it is up to us, each and every one of us, here today to not just shake it off, but instead to roll up our sleeves and to work together to strengthen Israel in maintaining vigilance so that Michal and all our brothers and sisters in Israel and those civilians in Gaza who are victims of Hamas too will all be able to lay down their heads at night every night in the fulfillment of the promise from our Torah. I will grant peace in the land and you will lie down and no one shall terrify you.